this video lesson is about determining the missing terms in an equation. To determine the missing number in an equation, first, work out the equation either forward or backward. Next, use the GEMDAS, which is group, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. And last, review the process or the processes to make sure that the answer is correct. So let me show you my examples so that you can learn and understand on how to determine the missing number in an equation. So my first equation is 5 plus blank equals 55. So in this equation, it should be equal on both sides. So as you can see, there is a total number on that left side. So we're going to find out what we are going to add by 5 so that we come up on 55. So can you guess what number are we going to add by 5 to come up also with a 55? That's right, it's 50. If you add 5 plus 50, it will give you an 55. And this equation is equal. Next number or next equation 2 times 3 equals 3 times blank. So in this equation, there is a missing term. Then later on, we're going to check if it is equal or not. Can you guess what is the missing term in that equation? Is it easy, right? That's right, is number 2. So let me show you on how to get the equal sides or the equivalent of the two sides it's 6 so if you multiply 2 by 3 it will give you a 6 and the other side if you multiply 3 by 2 it will give you also a 6 so that our answer of 2 is correct so let me show you another example so my equation is 12 plus 24 plus 34 equals 34 plus 12 plus blank so what do you think is the missing term on this equation To determine, work out the number either backward or forward. Okay, that's right. It's 24. So if you notice, there is 12 on the both sides and 34 on both sides. But there is the missing term on the other side which is 24 so that the answer on this equation is 24 so to check you can use a calculator and add the three numbers and you will come up with a 70 side by side try another example so my next number my, my next equation is 2 plus group 4 plus 5 equals 2 plus blank plus 5. So what do you think is the missing term on this equation? Please observe the number on the left side and on the right side. So what do you think is the missing term on this equation very good it's number four so if you notice there is two on both sides and five on both sides and just only one of four on the other side so the missing term on the other side is four 
again you may use the calculator to check if the both sides are equal so in this example i use the calculator and come up with the 11. next 6 multiplied by 2 and blank multiplied by 1 So in this equation, try to answer first the other side, which is, uh, has no missing term. So if you multiply 6 by 2, it will give you a 12. So what do you think is the missing term that if you multiply it by 1, it come up with a 12 of product? So what do you think is a missing term on this equation? And it should be a product of 12 also. So that it equal on the other side, which is the 6 times 2. Correct. It's 12. So check, use calculator. So 6 multiplied by 2, it will give you a 12. And 12 multiplied by 1, it will give you also a 12. So that our equation are now equal. Next, it's activity time. So I'll give you a 5 um, examples and give me the missing term. You may use a calculator to check if the both sides are equal so my first equation is 6 plus 12 plus 5 plus 7 equals 5 plus blank plus blank plus 12 so what is the two missing num term in this equation That's right, it's 7 and 6. Great job. Next. 7 multiplied by 6 multiplied by 5 equals blank. 6 multiplied by blank. So what do you think is the missing term? It's 7 and 5. That's right. So next. 24 plus 36 equals 36 plus blank. You may use the calculator to check if the both sides are equal. This example is just um, an easy one. Okay, that's 24. Another, last two. 7 times 10 plus 5 equals blank. Time is 10 plus 7 times blank. Can you guess the missing term on this equation? That's right, it's 7 and 5. Last number. 20 minus blank equals 6 plus 8. So a while ago, uh, I'll teach you on how. First, just add the two and just find out the other side so 6 plus 8 it will give you a 14 so that your answer on the other side it should be a 14 also so what do you think is the missing term on this equation
correct. That's 6. So, the missing term on this equation is 6. So, 20 minus 6, it will give you a 14. And 6 plus 8 is 8, 14. So, 14 is equal to 14. That's all.